This video was made possible by the EA Creator Network. Hi guys, it's Almosi here, so welcome to another apartment renovation. So today I am renovating this apartment, which is one of the Culpeper House apartments. As always, you can look on the top left-hand side of the screen to see the exact address if you want to place it in your game. That's where it goes. So this one, of course, is the one with the balcony, and I really wish more of the city living apartments had balconies. Um, just because it's so fun to decorate the little areas, especially with plants like I'm doing here in this apartment. So recently, well not so recently because I'm a bit behind, there were a couple of new kits released. There was a basement kit and a plant kit. I have both of them installed at this point and I look at a few of the basement stuff, but I don't think I end up placing anything in this apartment. I think it's all the greenhouse haven kit <laughs> and um yeah i really like it let me know what you guys think about it i built this apartment maybe about like a week or so ago and just haven't really had the time to edit the video and do the voiceover of course i'm sure most of you know by now if you've watched my most recent videos i have been not uploading as much well obviously <laughs> but um this is because my husband went back to work and so i've been caring for our two-year-old and so he does not let me record he wants a lot of attention <laughs> and he um if i am recording and he's like playing like close by or whatever he decides he doesn't want to do whatever he is doing and wants to play at my computer and he climbs and takes my mouse and you know it's just i it doesn't work basically. Um, and so I've been getting a lot of questions on like Twitter and stuff asking about that. So I thought I'd mention it again. And also in case you aren't on Twitter, you may not have seen, I am also pregnant. And so this is also adding to my not being able to record because I am sleepy. <laughs> like pregnancy makes me so tired. I was the same way with my son. And um, yeah, I'm due in August and i um, having a little girl and I'm very excited and um yeah i'm happy to be able to tell you all because i just um i'm always so cautious about like making like a big announcement too early or anything i am of course now almost seven months nearly seven months something like that so <laughs> i'm quite pregnant now um but yeah so when he's napping i'm napping basically and i don't get up early and i don't stay up late <laughs> So um, if I did do all of those things, I'd probably get more videos done, but I thought I would address that and let you guys know the news basically so you know what's going on. Um, but hopefully I can get more done. Uh, we're hoping that my son will start preschool in the fall. That's our goal. And so that'll free up a little bit of time. Of course, I'll have a newborn, but newborns sleep a lot. <laughs> and so um, hopefully I'll be able to get some done, but um, I'll do my best. Um, but of course they're gonna come first. Anywho. Now that that's out of the way, uh, this apartment has two bedrooms. I decided this is going to be for a single sim though. And so the second bedroom is more like a guest bedroom slash office. Um, I put the, um, the Murphy bed that we got from Tiny Living in there. And I thought that looked really cute because I don't think I've used that in a really long time. I mean, basically everything that I haven't used in a long time, but that one specifically, um, I think it's been quite some time since I've used one of the Murphy beds. So I thought it looked really good in the um, office, but of course, if you wanted to have like a roommate in here or a family, you could definitely have like a couple of kids in this apartment and they would fit in the room really easily. And my interior design choice for this apartment is very brown. <laughs> I wanted to keep it very just earthy and neutral because I really see this sim as just loving plants and nature. So there's lots of browns and creams and of course greenery from the plants and stuff. Um, but it's just like a really calming apartment because of those things I think. And I also kept to mostly modern furniture. I didn't specifically um, like try to leave out anything that I wanted to use that was more traditional. Like I think the fireplace is a bit more traditional and there might be like a couple of other things, but mostly it's modern items and mostly um, mostly neutral and so I think it looks really good and is really cozy and I really like this floor plan too I think I've done this floor plan more or less 
before. I mean, it may be like a tiny bit different with like the shape of the bedrooms or something like that. Um, but I really like this location for the kitchen and I love the little dining nook that I made with the couches and stuff. I thought that looked really cute. And the windows are from the greenhouse kit and the door that I'm using leading to the patio. And I like how it made it feel like it was a greenhouse turned kitchen basically. <laughs> and so I did consider making that like a bonus room um, or like an interior greenhouse sort of thing. Um, but I, I liked it for the kitchen. It just brings in so much natural light to the kitchen, which I think is just um, something nice to have in a kitchen basically. <laughs> um, yeah, and other than that, I'm using stuff from all sorts of different packs, Tiny Living, Eco Lifestyle, the uh, Desert Kit, I'm forgetting, I think it's Desert Luxe. Um, that's where these couches are from anyways, and I thought they looked really good in here. They match the color scheme perfectly, and they look really cozy. I like the texture on them, and they almost have like a sort of a suede texture. I don't think it picks up that well in the recording, but if you're looking at it in game, like you can really see the texture of it. Maybe I need like a stronger computer because if you guys didn't know, I've been using a laptop for like the past year or so, and it's worked really well for me. It's very hot though. I can only use it for like, mm, I don't know how long, but a short period of time. And then the keys start burning my fingers. And that's probably because I have tons of CC in. And also, I actually, I think I have my CC removed while I was recording this because with all of the additional packs and all of the CC that I have been accumulating, I'm getting too much. So I definitely probably should invest in a new computer at some point, but we did some traveling last year. And so getting a laptop was definitely the best option. And it's worked really well since, and I haven't really decided to like, cough up the money basically for a new computer because it's so expensive especially to get like the quality of one that I would like um, and build it myself too which makes it a little bit cheaper I think I don't know it's we'll see we'll see if I do it but, um, for now the laptop works pretty good um, over here is the bathroom I quickly decorated the hallway space the hallway is pretty simple but I love the bathroom I'm using some of the new items that we got in the what was the most recent pack growing together, I believe. Yeah, the sink and the shower. Um, I'm obsessed with the shower, especially. I really like it a lot. And then I also put a washer and dryer in there, which I thought was really convenient for an apartment to have. Maybe that was something that was like a really big perk about this apartment. Actually, like the balcony too. <laughs> like this is a nice apartment. Um, but yeah, this is going to be the office space. So it has a walk-in closet, it has the Murphy bed, and then I put a desk over here. And then I also sprinkle plants throughout the apartment. I didn't want it to be like, heavily like full of house plants but i wanted it to be still full of house plants if that makes any sense like every room has a house plant basically um i think i've said basically too much now but forgive me i'm very out of practice with voiceovers not that i've ever been that good at them but uh uh anyways yeah i wanted there to be lots of house plants but not like not too many so that might depend on your guys's preferences and taste if I put too many or not, but I don't think I did. I definitely think I could have put a lot more, but anyways, over here is going to be the bedroom. For the bedroom, it's again, very neutral, um, quite modern, but um, I think it's full of nice different decorations. Of course, there's plants, there's a nice little wardrobe over here, and then I put a few clutter items over here, like some shoes and something else. I'm forgetting exactly what. And then I put these really nice prints of some um, leaves up on the wall and I do like them. I don't think they match this apartment necessarily just because the white frames I felt like, I don't know, didn't really like blend into this apartment. I wish it had some like brown frames or black frames or something, but I like that they had the leaf prints so they work and then I put a few more plants over here and then I put some artwork above the bed and that's it for the bedroom and then of course the balcony so this is where the sim probably spends the majority of their time there's a little table out here there's of course a ton of plant stuff so this is where you'll see most of the stuff that came with the kit and so there's like this side table there's a nice little arranging table there's pots there's different clutter pieces like um the ones that I'm placing over here on this table, there's little planters and then there's like the cluster of planting supplies with like the uh, fertilizer I'm guessing and like a watering pot and um, yeah, it's super cute. I really like the way the balcony turned out. I also put a couple of functioning planters out here so the sim could actually do some real gardening. And then there's the flower arranging table that came from Seasons. So some flower arranging could be done. Of course, you could also swap it out for something else if you 
don't really like flower arranging, but um, yeah, I thought it looked really good over here. And then I made sort of a little plant thing <laughs> above it um, that I thought looked really nice. And then I also hang up some string lights and add a few more decorations to the side table over by the windows. But yeah, this is basically it for the whole apartment. I'm just adding those final few details like I mentioned, but I hope you guys have enjoyed this one and definitely look forward to one coming out with the basement items because that'll be coming out pretty soon. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching and please leave any comments or suggestions you have and I'll talk to you guys soon, bye. Took a blow, turned a cheek Those lessons cut me deep I've never been the same Pin it bright or monotone Deep splashes of black In pain the contrast grows Make a masterpiece of mess Even unknown Truth, black and white, took years to untie the 